today we are updating some listing photos for my aunt and uncle's beach house in North Carolina. We're just gonna do a couple of interior photos with flash for some updated renovated rooms. So thanks so much for joining. Now let's get into it. Hi that's, mom. That's all? There's my mom. Hi. <laughs> We made it. They just recently renovated this whole segment of the house. It's called a crofter because it randomly flooded due to some fires that they had on this island. It's kind of a crazy story. Literally the day after we left filming my course. All right, so plan is to just get a shot from this direction, add a little flash pop up there to fill it in a little bit and then for this bathroom hello i think i'm probably just going to get an hdr shot from this corner with the door closed because it's pretty well lit in here and i'm not sure that flash is really going to add that much so that's gonna be easy so up here they did update this bathroom over there so we're just gonna get a shot from here that's the main shot get a shot just showing this bathroom and they've got a nice new shower as well. So hopefully this helps you. So now let's go get started downstairs where I left all my gear. <laughs> I'm gonna be filming on this, so hopefully it turns out okay. But first thing we wanna do is make sure all the windows are nice and even. So they're all flat because we had already staged it. But you wanna make sure there's not any like really harsh shadows or harsh sunlight rays coming in, making everything look bad. So I'm going to keep this real simple. We're going lights off today for this shot because it looks nice. Got some nice natural light color coming in. I'm going to close this so that yellow is not leaking in. And we are just going to set up right here. Boom. Ready to go. All right. Uh, first time using 360 camera for my behind the scenes. So. We'll see if it is a keeper. So I'm just setting it up at about waist level with this tripod. We're just going normal setup. Got my flash, got my trigger. Got it on TTL at zero or plus three. And we're gonna expose for the ambient stuff. Get that window view a little bit showing a little bit better. See if that makes any difference. Polarizer. And we're about done. Just gonna be one shot probably. Let's go. All right, looks really good. Okay, so I'm just going way back in this corner so I can get the whole thing in the picture. Hiding my flash because I'm not gonna use it. Close the door. Shove this way into the corner. This is why flip screens are great. Get as much as we possibly can in that composition. All right, so I'm just gonna do a negative three plus three zero bracket. And so I'm just gonna go like that. So I wasn't in the mirror, but actually this camera was in the mirror. So I need to actually do this one more time. So here's what it looks like once it's edited. All right guys, and before we do the upstairs, I wanted to thank today's video sponsor, which is Epidemic Sound. If you are into real estate photography and real estate video, you're gonna need to get music. And that's one of those things that's gonna make your videos stand out and save you a lot of time ultimately in the edit and really wow your clients. And one issue that all of us are gonna run into is, is your music licensed correctly and legally and are your clients going to have copyright claims come up when they are posting this stuff to all their different social media channels and all that stuff so with epidemic sound with their commercial license package 
you're covered. It's super, super easy. You can just go into your account and add a link to the videos as they get posted, or you can even get your clients to do this by sending them an invite to safe list it. Then anytime they post it anywhere, they can just update that link, add more links to it. Wherever the video is used by your clients, you're good to go. So if you want to have great music and protect your clients from copyright claims, make sure that they can keep using those videos for all sorts of stuff. Epidemic Sound is the way to go. This is where I get all of my music for all my YouTube videos and my client videos and sound effects. They have a insanely huge library of music that is just always getting bigger and bigger. They're adding new stuff every month working with artists, which as a former musician, I think that's really, really cool. So if you haven't signed up already, make sure to use the link down below the video, do a free 30 day trial, try it out for free, get some tracks, get my real estate playlist and start using those in your projects and see what you think and start impressing your clients with the coolest music. So big thanks to Epidemic Sound for sponsoring this video and for sponsoring this behind the scenes series. Now let's get back to it. Ooh, check out that view. It's better up here. Definitely one of the best things about doing real estate and architectural photography. Anyways, back to work. All right, so we're just going back into this corner, making the room look as big as possible and getting everything in the shot. So I'm gonna make sure that that bathroom shows up in there as well. Because you want people to know immediately in one picture as much as they possibly can with rentals especially so you notice some harsh lines right there i'm going to fix that ready to go so we're just exposing for the ambient light and i'm going to go ahead and do my flash back up here and that looks good. So now let's move on to this bathroom area. And here's before and after editing with my presets. For most rental situations, you want to keep it as simple and as few images as possible. So pretty simple composition. I'm just going to go like this. And I'm going to adjust it a little bit in here. So we're gonna do a photo with the flash in this room and then a photo with the flash in the bathroom so we can match it. Okay, I'm showing up in the mirror, so I'm just gonna change the mirror just a tiny bit and we're good. So we're gonna go 10 second timer. I'm gonna run across the room over here so that I'm not gonna show up in the mirror. And we're just gonna fill up this whole room Let's see if I can get you guys in here. <laughs> I'm just doing it back in this corner so it doesn't show up on the camera. Hopefully I'm not in the shot. We'll see. We'll see. Yeah, that looks good. All right, so plenty to work with and we're set. <laughs> So here is how that came out with the two layers combined, pretty even and natural looking. And here's another bathroom that we also did that I didn't film where I actually used a orange gel to match my flash to the lights. So that was kind of a different situation. All right, easy little shoot. <laughs> so if you're new to the channel, thanks so much for joining. Hopefully this video was helpful. Um, if you want to see more tutorials like this, go check out my other videos and my course. Let me know if you want to see some more stuff about editing these photos and stuff like that. But once again, thanks to today's video sponsor, Epidemic Sound, for sponsoring this video. Uh, they've become a long-term channel sponsor, and I really, really appreciate them. They're just great to work with, and they support artists and creative people like us. So, great brand. Anyways, I hope you guys like this video, and... 
look forward to seeing you all in the next one. Peace.